What's going on? It's your boy Juggalo972 back here, and welcome to the lost episode of Juggalo972 Plays Chrono Trigger. Now, when I last left off, I uh, completed the game, and I told everybody that eventually that I would be fighting Specchio. Well, just like I had mentioned in the, uh, one of the previous episodes, that Specchio levels up with you. Specchio is Italian for mirror. Now, from level 40 to level 98, he is the gigantic blue Massa and Moon character, but when you reach level 99 at your max level, Specchio reaches something I, uh, that's called the peak new form. Now the peak new form is him at its uh, at his complete best. Now Specchio altogether has about 20,000 HP and has a couple of techniques that the whole party owns and repeatedly brings you down with just one technique. So shall we? Let's see. <clears throat> hey Punkhead, where you been? Absolutely, we're looking for some practice. There we go. Now, one thing you're going to notice, though, Specchio has Luminaire, uh, Dark Matter, Halitation, and uh, a move called Salt. What does it do? Well, you're going to have to find out just soon. Now, this attack, I'll tell you right now, well, correction, Specchio is the toughest boss in the game. Way more difficult than, ugh, that's like I say, way more difficult than Lavos. Of course, anything is more way more difficult than Lavos. So one thing I recommend you're going to want to do is you're going to want to consistently heal and make sure their HP is at a high level. Because at, I want to say about every turn that he's going to be doing, in between every turn he's going to be casting Halitation. Now Halitation, if you remember, uh, brings your HP down to 1, something that uh, Zeal used. We got very, very, very familiar with it though. So the best thing I could recommend right now is having 1 healer and 2 fighters. And before I know it though, 20,000 HP will go down quickly. <clears throat> Okay, here we go. Now your Water 2 and Ice 2 uh, attacks are not going to do that much damage. Oh, there we go. This is what I was talking about. This is where the healing has to come in handy. So, here's what we'll do. We'll cast Luminaire. And we're going to have Frog heal. Well, Glenn, if you will. We're going to have Glenn heal. Sorry. It's been a good minute since I played this. <clears throat> Now, I really don't consider this a quote-unquote lost episode. This is something that I caught up. But, oh! Yep. See, that's why you always want to heal. Halitation limbs you down. So, let's make sure that we're fully healed. Which we are. And let's get back to it. Okay. Here we go again. And there he goes with Luminaire. Like I said, Specchio means mirror. Ah. And look at that damage he leaves on you. Okay, so let's heal. And, uh, let's get my sword too, shall we? Now, one thing you'll also notice as well, too, is that I've done a significant amount of leveling up. Of course, I have to, in order to make it to where I'm at, though. However, I've been working on everybody else's stats. And, one thing you also recommend, too, that I also recommend, is using up all your tabs. Collect as many tabs as you can and use them. Because I'm going to tell you right now, New Game Plus guarantees a victory left and right. Unlike that. I'm going to tell you right now, Specchio is very unforgiving. So I'm gonna cast. I'm gonna put some berries on everybody. We'll, do, we'll give him luminaire as well. <sighs> this fight's gonna be long and dragged out. I'll openly admit that right now. Let's see. Let's cast haste too. Let's increase the speed, shall we? go and let's heal that's one thing I forgot to do was cast haste I can't tell you how many times I've been knocked out by him just by forgetting how to cast haste so let's bury your chrono oh look at that salt now this this is a completely different you know with any enemy this enemy right here specchio at his best, he actually heals you, which in some weird way actually gives you 
a second chance. I mean, honestly, I think it's a it's a good thing, but I'll tell you right now though, don't take his kindness for weakness. Hit him with Spire. Now, in terms of taking a chance though, one thing I'm gonna recommend is don't take a chance on him having you have him cast salt on you. I think a few of us are down. Good lord. It's a little ridiculous, I know. Well, let's break our white mage back. Okay. Here we go. Here it goes again with the uh, dark matter. Not too bad. But the cool part is we've got life too, so let's bring up somebody who can bring it back alive too. And here it goes again with halitation. back alive, and you know what? I'm going to use a Mega Elixir. We need a full recovery. Oh, man. And here it goes again with Dark Matter. Yeah, there's going to be a little bit of silence going around left and right, so... Oh, man. I'm just going to try to keep this, you know, as lively as I can, though, because God only knows... Well, as you've already witnessed, Specchio can take you down quickly. You know what it says, if you look weak, I look weak. If you look strong, I look strong. So let's show them that we're strong. There he goes again. Come on, heal up, heal up, heal up. And just to be on the safe side, we use a lapis. Just to be safe. And there goes the flare. He's definitely got some of the higher tier magic attacks on here as well. If you ask me though, that's honestly that's all he needs. Higher tier attacks though, and then halation. Or holitation, I think that's how you pr pronounce it. I don't necessarily remember, so you have to forgive me. Okay. Let's attack. Let's keep a heal. Let's keep a heal on standby. Got everything in the groove. Here we go. Just gonna be heal, repeat, heal, repeat. Come on. We just gotta be careful that he doesn't cast Luminary. Let's heal again, shall we? Oh, look at that! Okay, that was kind of a waste, but at least we're make at least we're making sure that we had an insurance policy right here. I sword two. I just need to get him where I can hit him uh, with the arc impulse. Let's heal. God only knows that's going to dwindle us down a lot. Okay. Here we go. Oh! Wrong move! Let's see, let's see, let's see. What's he gonna have? What's he gonna do? Oh, even better. We can use double cure. Make sure that we're at top health. Maximum health, here we go. And we'll hit him with Luminaire. That's another strategy I recommend. Make sure that you have haste on both uh, Glenn and Nadia, and then keep casting Luminaire. Okie dokie, here we go. Only a thousand. None too salty, I'll tell you that. Okay, now we can hit him with Arc Impulse. 
Here we go. Beautiful. Okay. Not too bad, not too bad. Now we can get away with the second one. So look, we're looking at about six to 7,000 damage right here. Here we go. Time to heal. Okay, here we go, here we go. Can never be too sure. He's a, oh, Lord. Yeah, we just ate it. Oh, okay, let's have another attempt at it, shall we? Alrighty. Okay, right to dark matter. I'm gonna bury everybody real quick. Maybe that'll save us a little bit. I'm not quite sure. At this point, though, I usually have Magus here to do, cast any, any kind of uh, defenses. Okay, let's heal real quick. Use a lapis? A lapis? I never, never knew how to pronounce that freaking name. <laughs> Alrighty. Dark matter again, here we go. Let's not try to take too many gambles, shall we? Okay. Spire. Let's see, did I hate who did I haste? Gonna have to haste our healer. And our white knight. Alrighty. Here's what we'll do. We'll double cure. Full health. Let's try the other uh, the other strategy. Let's see. I sword two. See, I got everybody speed up at the max right now. So hopefully this will come in handy. Alrighty. I sword two. That's a pretty good amount of damage though. Two thousand. Back pocket. A double cure. And a luminaire. Alrighty. Full health it is. Oh man. Sorry about the science, everybody, but sometimes you gotta focus. Okay. Let's paste for the frog. Oh, Glenn, I mean. <clears throat> there I go, reverting back to the names. I always kept them by their original. Okay. Be very, very careful with this. Hmm. No, I'm not gonna risk that. Saw what happened last time. Just to be, just to be a little sure, haste Chrono too. Cut your time in half. Alrighty. Back pocket a double cure. Oh man. So if anybody's ever played this game, though, I gotta ask you: Did anybody ever have any trouble fighting Specchio in the, in the very, uh, in the very final battle? Because I'll tell you right now, though, this is the ultimate test of the game. The ultimate test is Specchio, your mirror. I know I'm sounding like a, like a freaking, uh, like a broken record when I was this, though, but, you know, anytime I say that, though, but, oh, here we go. It's Arc Impulse, how about that? No, but like I said, though, you're, you're literally fighting your mirror. All he really needs, though, is just four elements. 
and with that, though, he even has the uh, audacity, well, not the audacity, but he's got the good heart to actually heal you. I think that's interesting. You know what, I'll take a gamble. Here we go again. Now, in case you didn't know, I actually have reset this game, so I can uh, get my shit together, too. There we go. Okay. You know what, just to be on the safe side, I got Kurtana. There we go. Can't move fast enough when you do that, though. Okay. Let's hit him with Luminaire. Okay, that's not too bad. Okay, okay. It's gonna be a little tedious, a little tedious, but I'd say we're about fourth quarter at this point, though. Third or fourth quarter. Go Cowboys, by the way. Alrighty, that was some damage. He's getting close. Let's see if I can sneak an arc impulse in. Alrighty, here we go, here we go. Getting, getting nose to nose. We don't have enough MP to really heal there. Double cure. You know, next time I'm just gonna use a Mega Elixir because we're running low on magic. Oh, look at that! One too salty. Okay. I've got enough for just one Arc Impulse at this point. Here we go, here we go. Booyah! Ultimate challenge has been completed. Ugh. Don't make a habit of this. Here, this is for you. Specchio's cheerful set. Ten magic tabs, ten speed tabs, ten power tabs, and ten mega elixirs. Received enough of Specchio's praise to last a year. Well, he is the master of war. Whew. <laughs> well. That was the ultimate test right there. Oh man, you can't. I, I've been uh, I've been at this for like 15, 20 minutes right now, and I've actually taken a small break though to to stop recording and to start all over again. Not to mention the fact I also reset the game too. But yes, this is uh, the actual final episode of Jungle 972 plays Chrono Trigger. Sorry for the lack of commentary. Um, it's been a while since I've uh, played this game, and not to mention the fact it's also been a while since I've actually done some commentary too. So I'm a little rusty, but I told everybody that I was actually going to finish it. I didn't know when, but I finally got around to it, though. I'm starting to get a little bit more time with my personal time as well, too, so I was able to actually get this off my bucket list. So, Juggle972 has completed Chrono Trigger. Alright, everybody. Well, I guess you can say that's the official end, so uh, much love and uh, peace!